Hello, this is Brad on YouTube again, and I have a fragrance review, and this will be on Diptyque's Oudel. And uh, this is the box that came in, a little sample, two mils. And, uh, and here's the, the spray vial. Really nice, uh, generous sample. Okay, and this was just recently released just back in 2010 and it's classified as a unisex fragrance and oriental spicy over base notes um, we don't have very many reviews yet but we did get five positives to one neutral and zero negatives so uh, nobody has yet to uh, trash talk this one yet um, the note breakdown top notes of cardamom Asari Cypress, Alimi, Juniper, and Peppercorn. Middle notes of Saffron, Calamus, and Black Tea. And in the base, Alibinum, Amber, Fernat Vanilla, Bourbon Vanilla, and White Musk. So I've actually uh, worn this fragrance uh, three times, twice to work and then once to church. Um, so I have a pretty good idea of what I'm working with here. I guess in a nutshell, I would say this is um, a uh, like a bourbon vanilla type smell with like a papery tea type base. It comes across as very, very light and transparent in a way. Uh, just um, the base is just so thin, um, but you can smell it. So. But um, it's, it's a lot different than any of the designer vanillas that I've come across. This one comes across as very um, exquis exquisite, exotic, kind of like that. Um, I think it's a nice fragrance. I do think it maybe leans a little bit more towards the, um, the feminine side, though. I would say maybe on scale 1 to 10, maybe about a 4.5 out of 10 on that scale towards the female end, I think, for me. Um, probably not something that I'll be buying, um, but, you know, I have kind of enjoyed it while I've been wearing it. Um, just a little bit too thin and maybe just a little bit too uh, unisex for my taste. Um, I think I prefer my vanilla is a little bit heavier, uh, you know, a little bit more masculine. A Yope Thrill or even Carlos Santana or two that... Uh, I enjoy the most, I think, right now. Um, so, uh, if I were to try to give you like a visual, what this kind of smells like, um, I know uh, Miguel when he reviewed it said it smelled like uh, some kind of a, a vanilla gin mixed drink. Well, I kind of get that. I guess there is sort of like that vanilla gin quality to it, um, but because of like that that papery. Uh, thin woods quality. It's almost like, like you're reading a book and you kind of spilled the, the drink on the book or on a napkin, and maybe just kind of, you know, smelled the napkin because of that papery type vibe. Um, or if maybe it's the tea I'm getting. There's like this uh, vanilla tea type aspect. I'm not really familiar with vanilla tea or or vanilla bourbons or anything like that, but. I kind of picture like a vanilla tea bag, maybe just a couple drops of um, some alcohol on there to kind of give it a little bit of a booziness. So uh, I would say that uh, if you really love your vanillas and maybe you're getting a little bit bored with uh, some of the uh, designer vanillas, maybe you want something just a little bit more transparent, not so thick and cloying. To me, this is almost like the exact opposite of Bulgari Black. A Bulgari Black had a very thick and gooey, heavy feel to it. This is like the opposite. It's like almost like airy, like cloudy. You know, it's this very light, um, transparent type like that. Um, but uh, I picture uh, women between like the ages of 30 and 50, kind of like the high society type women really enjoying this one. But I can see guys liking it too. Um, for me, I'm going to probably give it, uh, for smell, maybe about an 8 out of 10. Um, it is a little bit uh, cheaper than some of the other niche vanillas. I think uh, some people compare it to Guerlain's 
Spiritual Double Vinyl, which is probably about twice as much as this one. I don't know how they compare, but uh, yeah, if you want to try a niche vanilla, something that uh, isn't going to really break the budget, this might be worth checking out. It's called Ooh Dell by Diptyque. Thanks for watching, guys, and I uh, hope to do Tam Dial next week, which is a very popular Diptyque fragrance. Talk to you later.